let me repeat i have a feeling this is going to be the last part before the next act starts <laughs> um okay let's go over why not we need the fight we need the battle because we need this we need the experience and we're so freaking close this is slowly moving well not slowly it's, it's doing this thing oh no not what i want to do for the fight Oh, everything is spilled, I'm guessing. We have one spot left. Treason home is good for military and all of this that it has. But what else can we give it? Honestly, maybe a training ground. But it would be... Hmm... No... Smithy. Nope. That's not mercenary. No. Wow. All of glory. Cost of the recruiting mercenary unit, which actually may be a really good thing. Bellcast, maybe? Arsenal. Nope. Have to carry. Oh, maybe? I'm leaning more towards. Call of Glory. Hmm. I'm not sure. Arsenal adjoining building. We have a military. Who has the main? Spellcasters found. Do we even have them? We have a arsenal hall, main stables, main archery, main. I don't think we have main spellcasters outside of. Huh. That's something. Let's do Alchemist. Finish it off. Good enough. So that's everything for trees at home right now oh sure
not bad actually. Oh, the axe throwers. I freaking hate the axe throwers. Start at the end. This is very hit. Eh. I'd rather slow this down. Nine, oh, the Pananji. I just love the name of it. I think it slows it down, doesn't it? I feel like it should if it doesn't. Oh, yeah, minus one penalty for speed. Oh, why not? You're not gonna kill it, but... Oh, actually you may! Let's go! And then we'll still get that free shot after. Marksman does more damage. I wish I would have knew that a long time ago. Finish up. Oh. We one hundred percent got that. Armies are amazing. Oh, freaking amazing. Done. Oof. One back. Another one. Same or different? Uh, army one. Which is cool. That's the heroism. On the wolf. Oh, the church Why oh, not that? So is this just... Oh, 
Oh, we should have moved them here and did it. Kind of fine. Best friend. I really would love more church car. Let's wait till after the attack to see how bad. Oh, that's a van. It's not throwing it. That sucks. Others? Nanji are. We should have went the other way around. Ooh. Perfect. One, two, three, four. Not bad. How many are in space? Two squares, one, two, son of a gun. Awesome. What's your speed, my guy? Oh, eight. Oh man, that's crazy. There's no way you're not. It's not. Eh. Got to Ugh, so freaking 
<gasps> yes, perfect. Oh, long time freaking coming. Oh. Did you? How close are you at level A actually? Oh, not you. Class one, that was close. And you freaking level. You have. We don't have a. I, okay, so. We have Hunt, Ice Bomb, Mass Maneuvers 1. We have a lot of stuff. However. Oh, that's cool. We could do master maneuvers too, where we can add someone else who is just in the back burner or intimidation. I don't care about right now. Oh, flank, flanking grants plus. That's freaking cool. Offensive training. That's cool. Yeah. Oh, I feel like this is going to help us in the long. This would be great for Marching Terror. I feel like that's something that they would like. However. What do we have? In Favorite enemy large. They can outflank our master. This, I'm just gonna take So, who can we give up? We can give. No. Nope. Sorcerers, actually. this oh yeah no way no way and then oh this is five is going to work but it bring us to an eight that is them by itself is a level three. is crazy let's nah, let's just rest all the let's... paladins I've met before behave very piously they abhorred frivolity of any kind you're not like that at all 
You're not afraid to be yourself. The paladins you're talking about? They were easy to break, right? It's easy to break someone who's running from themselves. Hmm. Of command, I after seven freaking days. That's annoying, but it happens in the meantime, in between time. know what I watch tower and hospital you're full we've actually been doing well we have had no choice because of this which is still technically kind of cool are you moving I don't think you are This is our goal. In Watch Tower. Yeah. Archery. I think they were really good. Oh, wait. What? I still feel really good right now. At max, six days is what we need.
Alright, description is back up. Just keep going however long you can until it says everyone is really fatigued. Ah, keep hitting that. Your wings make you per make the perfect umbrella. Thank you for keeping me dry when it rains. And if I fold my wings like this, it makes a perfect shelter. Still not at level one. This should be at least like so we should be at least at five. Oh three perfect provisions fine with what let's do I don't know why it's doing this. It has buildings, but it's saying it doesn't. I don't know why. And it keeps doing. Oh well. It... A. And that's not clear. I don't care about that right now. There we go. serious I want church guards why can I not get church guards that's cool and all but I want the church guards <sighs> they're all free they are freaking cool though I'm not using more resources I'm not spending more money, I should say. The hopeless. Some soldiers have become disillusioned with the crusade and no longer believe in victory. These poor people are only at fault for losing hope, but their words are hurting morale. 
Recently, a group of recruits that had just arrived in Dresden attempted to desert after listening to the defeatist. I don't want to banish them. This is cool. I don't want to order them either. Increase. Oh. Add leadership point. Yeah, they lost hope. I just sent them back. Ember insists that both the deserters and the defeaters be relieved from their duties and sent home. People become heroes of their own volition, and one should not demand the impossible from soldiers. The officers were, dismi were dismayed by this decision, expecting morale to suffer this expecting morale to suffer disastrous damage, but the exact opposite happened. Once those scaremongers were gone, the crusaders inspired by Ember's words Rush into battle with renewed strength and somewhat grim cheerfulness. So, leadership, which is we don't even need that anymore, really. But we do in the long in the long game. Morale increased, recruitment growth reduced by fifteen percent for twenty days. Eh, that's fine. Is that this release from service? Nope, not you more is watching there. Well, they can come to us at this point. They We're so close right now I can taste it. Early. Let's just why not? Let's press. I don't care that much about you fight demons with such joy. Do you really enjoy their suffering? Darren? Uh oh Bert. shove that somewhere else. Mm. Demons are demons. Why are you sympathizing with them? All right, we hear corruption. Ah, uh, but <sighs> we'll rest after we do. Yeah. We'll rest after we do the meeting after for the rank. Nabasu, Skeletal Sharpshooter, Champion, Necromancer. Let's go! So, Heroism. Obviously. Should've did the full thing. Just wait. What is that? Death is still engaged. Oh. I mean, I kind of want to do you, but at the, oh, no, sharpshooter. Oh, who? Is someone on this square? No, why? 
That's fine. Next mountain. Oh, not bad. Let's go here. Please don't hit the guard. Oh, crap. There. Still so. Still not good enough though to defend. Your others, you're fine. Cleric. Let's defend. Then let's wait. I freaking hate this. I don't know what that is. Not bad. Oh, they perfect. Unstock. And then let defend. So What are you actually? I'm not a necromancer either, but not you. What are you? Champion. Nutri evil. Makes sense. No idea. Well, it's only 11 of us. So, 11 days. Fine. Come on, let's try to be Not bad. And even though it will be. No, just attack. So, it'll make more sense to uh, move into that next round. finish them off. Ooh. Oh, have I been not using you properly? Like, my... On this, uh... Ah, uh, how? 
1d6. Yeah. It's fine though. Oh no. The fan. Probably should have did the flank thing with that level up, but it's fine. Blackwater way. Interesting. I much, I would much rather them come to us and skip days. Let's skip hours, not days. The young pampered nobles sent by their family to the crusade have become skilled fighters. Yay! Rank up. The war wears soldiers down and defeatist attitudes sink in. In order to reinforce the discipline, the commander staff council must look for new solutions. You know what? Why not? Faultless daybreak. It carries over, so. Not terrible. Wait, what was that? Oh, that. Never mind. Um, actually, press. Closest thing to love with thing we've ever got. A gold dragon, like a big shiny rooster, and he's so nice. I like them right away. There? Yep. Another nauseating model of piety. I can easily picture him sharing an evening cup of tea with his virtuous Mendevian clerics. I am certain he drinks nothing stronger than that. That's fine. Do you even have anything else that... I honestly have no clue. There we go. Four. Nope. Hamlet. Oh. Oh. Don't even know. Don't even remember where this is. And at this point, don't care. We need the four. Keeper's Canyon. Keeper's Canyon. Sounds like something where I want. Something that's four spaces. Um, garrison spell cast launch. Is this like the main thing?
Hmm. No, it's not. Hospital in Watch Tower. Stable Barracks. Let's do an N. Castle. Hmm. Let's garrison barracks. Let's do... Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's not a ter it's not like game breaking. It's not gonna deal with it. Um Thirteen. Oh, I thought it was gonna blow up. The chain of command of the crusade has been strengthened. The staff council requests that the crusade leader attend their meeting and receive an update report. Yay! And then let's just make life easier so we don't rest in this Martian Terror Wow Safe Look, female, some of the pictures. You got, you can go. And then. Because we can, and because we should. <sighs> so freaking close. 
you fly. No, I should have traveled around. I knew it. I don't know about the spell caster. You got him back. I'm the, trying to decide do I want to switch the spell cast, keep them, or switch them out with someone else. Like someone else, on, like another cavalry unit or infantry unit. Maybe cavalry though, because I like the idea of them being having the two different. Um, next. Save. And no terrors. Where is he? Did we fight them? No, we. There we go. Then look how wait, 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 we've gone over. All right, let's enter, do the council thing, and then rest. Enter. Good though. Imprisonment begins in one own own's mind. Baphomet. Let's go. We haven't seen you in forever. Harmonton? Yeah. Commander, permission to report. Captain Harmonton looks worried. The army's disposition is growing dangerous. 
more and more soldiers express their distress towards you and your mythical powers? What? They grumble their lack of understanding of where you are leading them and what your plan is. What's worse, the worry have once again emerged from the officers. They are adding, adding fuel to the fire of sedition, and we've already had cases of direct insubordination. You have to win back the trust of the soldiers forthwith, or else the army will be paralyzed. Some privates must have already refused. Some privates have already refused to march into battle. I suggest that we make your strategy clear by setting up a bulletin board. It could have a new statement with your name on it every week. Every two weeks, you will invite delegates from your soldiers to ask any questions they may have. It feels like the soldiers are discouraged and dismayed. We should embolden them by reminding them that the crusade is about more than just death and danger. That it is a time and that it is a time of camaraderie and valor too. Maybe we can adorn the city with an inspiring monument, monument of two or two, the kind that lifts your spirits whenever you walk by. Soldiers have the right to ask their generals questions, but they have no right to disobey orders simply because their curiosity isn't being satisfied. They are committing sabotage, and the penalty for, cap for sabotage is a court-martial. We'll build new taverns for our soldiers and pour them free beer on the commander's behalf. That's the easy way to win their <laughs> The wary again? I thought we took care of that problem. Ooh, not completely, apparently. The captain makes a helpless gesture. We haven't yet solved the main issue. Far too many officers still believe that the queen herself should be in charge of the crusade. No matter how many feats you achieve, they still consider you an upstart. We have to do something about them soon, but the unrest among the soldiers is the most pressing matter at all. Matter at all. Ooh. <sighs> we need a ten. What do you think of the wary? They are your comrades in arms, after all. Or the 13. I think of I think of them as traitors. Commander. Hermiton replies quickly and firmly, but his expression darkens for a moment. What is exactly that my soldiers find worrying? Your mythical powers. Yes, they do secure us one victory after another, but even though most loyal troops raise questions from time to time, they wonder, what are you? Are you mortal like the rest of us? Or perhaps an emissary from uh, from other spheres, and if so, then which ones? Are you truly fighting for Crusaders' causes, or do you have your own ulterior motives? All of this pawns the way for endless speculation. Let's discuss the option. We're not doing Darren's at all, Darren. There are centuries all care for grouches and and complainers, alcohol and a little cheer. We'll build more taverns, supply them with strong beer, and treat the soldiers once or twice, courtesy of the treasury. They'll leave their doubts behind in the blink of an eye and proclaim, and proclaim you the best and most beloved commander who ever lived. But if we stop doing it, they'll start hating us again. I'll be the first to agree that taverns are a good thing to have, but they're not enough to support the army's fighting spirit. If we don't give our soldiers something more than drinks, our taverns will just become places to drown their sorrows or vent their frustrations through brawls. See, look. I have doubts that explaining battle strategy will help our people in any way. They're fighting a brutal war, maybe the worst war in Galorian's history. They're exhausted and scared. If we want to help them, we have to give them courage. We have already made, we are already making an effort, but I would also suggest, suggest adorning our fortresses with monuments, not grim ones, but something heroic or uplifting. That way soldiers who are about to march on or have just marched in will be able to smile at them like old friends. I had a marble friend like that once. The recruits in our order believed that rubbing the hilt of his stone of his stone sword will bring you good luck. Dismissing mutinous talk of acts of exhaustion and lack of support is fundamentally wrong. Those few with conscience serve well and true as it is, without question. However, those who can afford to doubt and ignore their orders are to step away from becoming deserters. We will remain deaf to any pleas and arguments, and even more so to inspiring to inspiring embellishments. Regal? The insider's body thank you from the gallows. <laughs> the insider's body is hanging from the gallows will answer any and all questions. Sedition must be extinguished swiftly and mercilessly. It's absurd even to consider convincing or appeasing the doubtful. That couldn't be more counterproductive. The sight of hanged bodies would absolutely stop the soldiers from asking questions. 
but it won't stop them from thanking them. For example, will they hang me next? Did I have a mis did I make a mistake by joining this army? Isn't it about time I make a run for it? And Captain? If the soldiers don't understand you, then you must bridge the gap between you and them. Create means of direct communication, so to speak. We'll set up a bulletin board that will, simply put, keep everyone informed of the situation on the front and the basis of our strategy. In addition, we'll set up times when once every two weeks, now this may have to come here every two weeks, the soldiers can send delegates to you and ask any lingering questions. A general is about, a general is under no obligation to report to their soldiers. They'll end up disputing your every word and second guessing your orders for you know it. In some exceptional in some exceptional cases, a general may seek counsel from experienced veterans. But turning your headquarters into a thought fair is the surest way to destroy your authority. Ability board? <laughs> Pray tell, how many of our soldiers can actually read? Maybe we should engrave this board with something with some obscene carving. Then it would be at least useful. I was thinking about the captains until <sighs> Reggio made a point. But I know I'm not doing Darren's, so Darren's what's your thing? Reduce all moral facts and coming by 10. Only one Terran can be built in these forts. Reggio, I know we're not doing you. Gallows decrease the chance to skip action due to negative combat morale by 3. By uh, For all units, only one Gallo can be built in these forts. Captain, it's either you or Sigla. A bulletin board provides all units a plus three bonus to the chance to act twice due to positive battle morale and a minus three bonus to the chance to skip action due to negative combat morale. Only one bulletin board can be built. Yeah, yeah. Monument. A monument provides all units with a plus five bonus to the chance to act twice due to positive combat morale. Hmm. I really wanted to do this. I really did. But Virgil made a point. And see, this is less cost effective and time effective. We don't have time for all. Of, and we can do a weird monument. So, monument. Well, do. I hope this will help in some way. All right, let's take this. Let's see. Let's rest. 